So uh, there's also art, an exhibition. Oh yeah, really, it's also an exhibition. Oh, yeah. Hello. Yeah, <laughs> thank you. Uh, I'm good. <laughs> so uh, uh, I was uh, actually I didn't recognize this place before, to be honest, because I, I was like downstairs for somebody who says like, oh yeah, there's like an art gallery, and there was like Salonia. I was like, ooh, where is it? And then I found this found this little place here. So I can can I just like yes, I walk? Of course, yeah. yeah. The gallery is through the double doors. Yeah. There's an introductory yeah. video yeah. in the first room on the left. Yeah. The bathrooms are further down here. Oh, on the right. left hand side and we just do refreshments here tea, coffee and cake very nice okay. alright thanks okay. a lot so I have a, have a look hi there An oral history? <laughs> Where was this coming from? Uh, all right. Can you tell me what this is? <laughs> Probably, if you're not shy to be on tape right now. Oh. Uh, <laughs> it's all right. <laughs> actually, you're looking good, so it's all right if you want to. Hi there. <laughs> so what's this actually? Um, it's a piece by Martine Sims. She was kind of examining hand gestures. Right. What they used to mean and what they mean now. Okay, because I was like, I was stepping in, she was like, ow, ow, ow. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> so, uh, this is very um, confusing, to be honest. Uh, <laughs> so, you're work, so you working also here, like in the, in the gallery itself? Or? Yeah, yeah. Alright. So. I'll give you uh, more information. <laughs> you, you try to walk, walk yourself around the camera. It's alright, you can say hello. <laughs> <laughs> so Martine Sims is number three. So mm. She's just here. Okay. And then all the rest of the artists are all are all labeled here. Mm -hmm. And you can get more information on the back here about each of them. So she works in video and performance. Mm -hmm. In this film she uses the seventeenth century text. Mm -hmm. Unnatural language of the hand to look at the gestures and oh, communicate okay, okay, how they okay. resonate across time and how they change. Yeah, okay. Now, now I see what what, <laughs> what what she's trying to do actually. Yeah, it's like it's a really good piece. Yeah. So, what's the name, by the way? Lisa. Hey, Lisa. I'm, I'm Daniel, nice to, meet, nice to you. meet you. Lisa will guide me around for mm, five minutes. Okay. Maybe you have like five minutes yeah. or so. You're, so. So you're from Lismore? Or? I'm from Ballydoff. Which from is from where? Ballydoff. From Ballydoff? Yeah. Where is it? It's just about 10, 15 minutes from here. Okay. So, but you actually you have, you have an American accent. You sound, you sound pretty American right now. No, I'm Irish. Oh, okay. I'm from because the guys I already met, they, I had to ask some uh, questions twice because I didn't because they were so fast. And, like, da -da 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 -da, and I was like, Ugh. and then he he just said like totally um, normal things I would say. But you sound pretty. I don't know. You sound a little bit American though. So oh, <laughs> okay, all right. So we have a full-blooded, uh, um, hundred percent Irish Lisa here, and she will give us a little tour around. Charlotte Croger. Okay. She is a Glasgow based artist mm -hmm. and she, when she was studying in the Californian um, University of Arts she found these photographs mm -hmm. and they were of puppet making gestures 
but she reinterpreted them and re-photographed them with her own hands in the frame. It's, it's her? It's her hands? Those are her hands. Ah, okay, because this uh, looks no, very manly though. <laughs> no, no, so it's kind of like retaking the gaze from a masculine standpoint to mm -hmm. a more feminine one. Okay. Yeah, so she reinterpreted the images in that way. I see. And they I look see. really different out of the puppet making context if you just if you didn't know that. No, of, 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 that. Co of course I don't because I'm a musician, so uh, <laughs> I'm, I'm like not, not that much with, with, with um, visual arts. But most of the time, everywhere where I go, I, um, I try to, you know, educate myself a little bit in arts. So you are educated in arts or yeah, you studied? Yeah, I have a degree in oh. art history. Where? Like in, like in Dublin or? Yeah, from Dublin, yeah. yeah. Sorry. <laughs> I see it. <laughs> So this is all from her, right? These so are the, all the her photographs here. Okay. And then these paintings are by Lynette Yairongochi, and she painted them all in one sitting, and there were no sitters. They're completely from her imagination. Okay, but she, she so she is also she's in black. She's black, or, or why yeah, why did she, she choose like she okay? Is, sorry, so, yeah. uh -huh. Okay. So they're not really situated in any point in time. Mm -hmm. You can just interpret them any way that you want. Yeah, of course you can. This is like, maybe she's like a little bit, hmm. And they framed them so that they're all eye level as well. Hmm. So what do you think about them? What's your interpretation about those pictures? As an educated, as, as, a, as a person with a degree from Dublin? I, I love them, I think they're great. Mm -hmm. Because the theme of the exhibition is palimpsest, which means something that used to have one, one meaning mm -hmm. and now it has another one, so kind of layers of time. And she's painted these so that they're not situated in any point in time. Mm -hmm. So every single person can have a different opinion on them, mm -hmm. a different view. Yes, I do. Actually, though, this guy looks very, I don't know, like like a funky one, like, you know, I'm, you know, like a very happy. And she's like, she's like thrown into the situation. Yeah. Yeah, oh, really? I, 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 yeah that's good. And he's more like, I think he's like the mix maybe out of two. He's like, uh, I don't know right now what I can do, but actually I think I cope with it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, see, it's even, even even a little bit more fun right now, but it's it's off season here, right? Yeah, it is. It's okay. kind of just coming into the most quiet period, and it actually finishes up. The 13th of October okay. until March. They do one main exhibition every year. So. Mm -hmm. Okay, so so um, so you work in here during the season. Yeah. Okay. What do you what you doing during the off season? Uh, to be confirmed. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Ah, ah, I see. And this is a photograph by Zoe Leonard. Yeah. And Ad, yes. um, sorry, that's the video who's running there, right? That's Martin Sue. Ah, yes, okay. Mm -hmm. artists, which this is an American photographer, and this is kind of symbolizing nature taking back an industrial street. You know what kind of you know that that uh, that type of tree? I, I don't know the type of tree. I I know. Do you? I don't. It's a plane tree. You know what a plane tree is? You have to Google it, probably. It's not because it's a, an airplane, it's a, just called a plane tree. You've seen this before a couple of times. Because I am, when I'm not doing uh, um, uh, music or doing this here, right, I'm a Arborist. You know what the arborist does? Trees. <laughs> yeah, it's like I'm a tree climber, so I, I run a little tree company in, uh, and, and where I'm from? <laughs> Which country where I'm from? Guess it. Actually, I asked every person I met right now where I'm from. I'm really bad at accents. Oh, really? So, I'm, I actually, actually my, my accent is really straightforward, I would say. So, can you? Yeah, of course. Oh, yeah. <laughs> See? Not so bad. Yeah. So, <laughs> um, yeah. Swedish. That, that's Swedish? <laughs> um, uh, yeah, maybe. But um, for Swedish, I, I'm not like tall enough, I would say. <laughs> so, yeah, um, that's a plane tree. And of course, we have a lot of these. And you know why this happens, by the way? Um, because um, the um, because of the roads. Actually, you see um, uh, those. Uh, 
the roots like coming up because they have no space anymore and the uh, and the tree was there before before the streets most of the time and then of course they're cutting the roots round about and then they you know so they're just gonna go back they're, yeah they're trying to and then they're cracking up the 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 roads and this and that so the more you know <laughs> is it really so interesting so that's that's everything or is there, is there more in this direction I was in this room already. Yeah. Ah, okay. So that's actually because he kind of talks about every single piece as well. If you want to know more. Ah, okay. Yeah. But I like to talk with real people. <laughs> that, that's that's what I do most of the time. Yeah, yeah. Your your colleague already offered me um, uh, some if I want to. But what's there? That's like the cafe, or it's like a seating area. Okay. Uh huh. <laughs> yeah. Then uh, I have to thank you a lot for yeah. for your time. Yeah. She she's not shy to be on camera right now. Oh, the camera. Yeah, you didn't recognize that the camera's she didn't gone. Know. <laughs> I really. <laughs> I just asked, like I did her, like on uh, on her before, and then it's alright. But she was very shy in the beginning, and and and, <laughs> and, and later on, la later on, it's alright because I think I I'm a humble dude, so <laughs> I, I, I I don't do do any any nasty things. So uh, you can watch those um, videos if you want to. I, I show it on your on my I, I I you know I write you on my side yeah. if it's alright for you. Yeah, yeah. Oh really? Yeah. It's. Uh, it's actually, uh, so it's like a guest book, right? Yes. Oh, all right. So, and when do you close this, um, uh, this, uh, this castle, uh, this, this gardens? Are they closed at some time or uh, uh, during the winter or are they open all year? No, the season runs from March until October, middle ah. of October. Ah, okay, that's why, so that's at why. That point, oh, okay, but that's the, so that's why actually uh, in the, in the, um, I was like uh, for 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 lunch at this place called um, Foley, uh, the Hall of Foley, Foley? or so. Foley's or whatever. Actually, it was pretty good. And uh, she also said like, "Oh yeah, geez, pff, I'm so glad that the season is over already." <laughs> so because it must be very uh, um, uh, um, a fuss here or like a trouble, right? From yeah, busy with people. Yeah. 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 All right. Yeah. So right now it's just like you know. It's winding down. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> We're getting ready to hibernate. <laughs> okay. That's pretty nice. Yeah. yeah. So is there something else uh, that, uh, except for the fact that um, uh, downstairs the um, uh, the guy on the entrance already said there's another level here downstairs. There's another garden, lower garden. Yeah. Okay. So some of you want to guide me there as well. Well, if you go down now, we have to close here. So yeah. if you go down. The garden, we're closed here, the yeah. coffee shop and the gallery is closed at 5, but the gardens are open until half past 5. Okay, so this is actually, uh, uh, this is like, actually it's already 5. Yeah. yeah. So it's like half an hour, right? Yes. So I have to hurry up. It's, 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 is, is it big down there or? No, the upper gardens are bigger than the lower. Okay. So right then I will. Have you had to look around here? Yes, for sure. Um, uh, yeah. because of the thing, like I told you already, I'm an arborist. Like I'm, I'm climbing oh, trees. Wow. Okay. And what you, of course, didn't know, uh, didn't you, when I was like, I don't know, like in my when I was like 19, 18 or so, um, I learned the um, the job. Or uh, like in Germany, we have like you have if you do like craftsman um, jobs or so, um, you will learn the um, like you have like an education of three years. And I am educated in um, uh, orchard. I'm an, I'm an educated orchardist. You know what an orchardist is? Which? An orchardist. Orchard. An so orchard. Orchards? Yeah, Oops. like yeah, and I'm an, yeah, okay. yeah, and I'm was like um, educated in fruit trees. You know, I don't know how to explain this, pretty much. So yeah, I was uh, uh, um, a little bit um, sad about the fact that many trees here are already dead. There's so many dead trees up there. <laughs> Yeah, it is. It they, is. Yeah, but they've run their lives yeah, as such. Yeah. And I suppose I don't know anything about fruit trees, but I would imagine that 
a certain varieties have a shorter lifespan than but others, would they? It, it does, it, it depends, it depends yeah. most of the time. But I can tell you like an hour right now because the, the how and why, but uh, I'm, I'm pretty sure. You, you, yeah. <laughs> First, this, this, and unfortunately you won't be that interested <laughs> in, in it because you are in, educated in other um, uh, artistries. Or we can talk a little bit of jazz because I'm playing jazz piano. So, if you're into jazz, 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 jazz. Do you like jazz? A electronic music, probably. Techno. You're into rock music, right? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm not into rock music. But you're into jazz, huh? I like jazz. Yeah. See? <laughs> At least somebody who likes jazz. All right, guys. Um, thank you very much for your time. Thank you. And, yeah.